Good afternoon. Uh, Ms. Ongo Sibuti is my name uh, from Market Force, and I'm here to tell you about uh, the super app that we are building for 100 million um, informal African merchants. So in Africa, we have about 100 million uh, dukas or kiosks, the small shops that actually serve about 90% of the population uh, to get their daily food. Um, that's about 1.3 billion uh, consumers, and these informal merchants track, uh, transact over 1 trillion um, transactions in a year. So what does this market look like? It's mostly divided into um, two main uh, players. That's the FMCG manufacturers and distributors. So these are your Colgate, um, your Diageo, Elori, uh, Nescafe, Coca-Cola, Danone. So mostly the day-to-day -day, uh, products that people actually consume. Um, we also have the informal merchants um, serving as the main banking agents for most of the consumers in Africa. So that's across mobile money, insurance, banking, um, and even for your bill pay uh, for day to day. So paying for your TV, you will go to your nearest informal merchants, and that's why you will uh, pay for the TV. So these merchants have three key main problems, which is one is stockouts in the shops and expensive sourcing, uh, because they mostly have to close their shops to go into the wholesale um, providers for them to be able to get the products. And during this time, they actually lose on sales or get the consumers frustrated. And because they do not have a transaction history, um, because of being under digitalized, then they also have lack or lack access to credit uh, because of informal uh, transactions. That also leads to poor financial management across most of the informal merchants uh, because of lack of tools um, and they aren't tracking their day-to-day -day transactions um, using any formal means, so mostly they do pen, pen and paper for that. Um, so that, the person you're seeing up there is Lydia. You can see she's very happy and excited today. Um, and that's because of the tool we've built called Reja Reja, which combines all the services that um, these informal merchants offer into one uh, super app. So when Lydia signs up on Reja Reja, they, they get a wallet, which they can use as their go-to banking platform. So they can deposit money there. They get paid uh, through the Reja Reja wallet, and they can also send money to their consumers through the same wallet. They can also buy products for their shop um, on the same platform and be able to restock without actually having to leave um, the shop to go to the wholesale business for them to get uh, stock for the shop. Um, and because of this digitalization, we've also been able to offer um, better visibility uh, to manufacturing and financial service providers. And this has helped them to access a wider retail base. They also are able to get real-time um, market intelligence and now have data-driven marketing and distribution. Um, to the market. Um, so what has been our progress so far? Um, through this, we've been able to get 5% take rate for the business, and we also do a 10% um, take off on marketing and uh, buy now, pay later product, which allows the retailers to be able to get the products without actually having to pay for them beforehand. Um, so our traction so far, we've been able to go into five uh, African countries. That is Kenya, Nigeria, Uganda, Tanzania, and Rwanda. Uh, we are operational in 21 cities um, and are currently providing the service to over 200,000 merchants across these markets. Um, so far, we've been able to generate over 750,000 orders. That's over a period of about... Um, 24 months, uh, the bus, we've seen the retail ba merchant uh, basket growth increase by three times over this period and have generated sales um, of around $20 million uh, in gross monthly revenue. So the team, um, we have a very exciting team, um, and uh, we've also been able to exit before in two companies. 
Um, our team covers uh, professionals from uh, Safaricom, which is one of the biggest telcos in Kenya, American Express, Kenya Airways, PwC, um, PZ Carsons, and uh, the likes. So um, what is more important to me is actually what we've been able to do for the informal merchants. Now, these are the people that are driving 90% of the economy in Africa. So when you grow the retail merchants, you're actually growing the African economy in general. So I'm excited to tell you that since we started working with merchants, we've seen at least 18% increase um, income uh, for the merchants. And that's because they can now access goods in real time and are also able to offer financial services to the end consumers because these are the people that they interact with daily. We've also been able to provide 100% financial inclusion for all the over 200,000 merchants that we are actually working with. So this means that now any merchant that is on the Reja Reja platform, they can access credit after transacting with us for over one month. And I'm also happy to say that we've created over 500 informal jobs in the economies that we are operating in. Thank you. Um, you can reach out uh, to find more uh, through uh, to me on Marketforce at mysongwatmarketforce.io. Thank you.